it's your boy, Mr. Flight Academy Kicks, aka Pass the Flight, Shoot Flight, Flex Luger. Call me what you want, but can't play the boy broke. They should I'm be rich in Christ, man. Back with another video as usual. If you have already, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Then we rock with the flight crew. You don't have fun. Before we get started, I want to send a message out. I told y'all I'm coming for the early review crown. So make sure you follow me on IG, Flight Academy, underscore kicks with a Z. It's your boy, Mr. Flight Academy Kicks, aka Pastor Flight, Sure Flight, Ghost Candy Man, all them great names. Call me what you want. Cannot call your boy broke because I am rich and Christ, man. Back with another video for y'all today, man. And if you have not already, I really don't know what you're waiting on. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit the subscribe button right now, man. Y'all make sure y'all sub up, man. It's greatly appreciated for the growth of this channel as we continue to make moves and as well as subscribe to my second channel, Life of Flight, man. I will have that in the description, man. Make sure y'all tap in and tune in, subscribe over there. Y'all see some videos I done dropped already. Got a little surprise for you as well. So make sure you head over there and tap in with that channel as well. And if you ain't follow me, make sure you follow me on IG, Fight Academy underscore Kicks with a Z. And follow my store page, Fight Academy Kicks underscore LL. And as well as you can follow it up with hitting your boy on Twitter, Fight Academy underscore K, man. So we are here with another video for y'all today, man. A very interesting topic we want to talk about today. I want to show y'all a shoe that I actually picked up. And I picked up the shoe and then found out the next day that the, the release actually got canceled. Um, but uh, I still kept the shoe. You know what I'm saying? But um, I'm going to get straight to it, man. And honestly, oh, I didn't mean to do that. But anyway, to keep it a boat with you, I didn't even get to do a review on them. So technically, this could still be considered an early review. But I picked these bad boys up the other day, man, from my local detail arm man, one on the raffle. Um, was able to pick them up, bro. I picked up these pairs and um, got them, received them, and then I got a call like, hey, that shoe got pushed back to July 2nd, and we just got notice of it, you know what I'm saying? So I was able to get it. I know some of y'all actually might have even hit on online, man. So listen, if you hit online, you might want to be expecting a cancellation email soon, or they might cancel shipment. They might still give it to y'all, though, because I remember that happened with... Um, I think it was the University Blue Ones. Either one of the retro ones, the release date got pushed back and they had already released them. What shoe was that? Was it the snakeskin ones? It was one of the shoes, man, but they pushed back the release um, and the stores got late notice of it. Actually, it was Jimmy Jazz, I think, that it happened to. And they still went ahead and shipped the shoes out to people, man. So hopefully, they still shipped them out to y'all. But yes, man, this shoe has got pushed back to July 2nd. And it's kind of funny because... A lot of people didn't know that the release date was on Wednesday. Um, unless I'm missing something, which I could have. I, I've been kind of in and out of the sneaker game, man. But I'm back 100% right now, man. Um, but when I was when people seen me pick them up, they were like, where you getting the ones from? And I'm like, they dropped today. And I'm like, I know y'all ain't playing the retro ones like this is bad. But then now I'm starting to notice that everybody must have known that they had got pushed back except for these certain stores, man. But I kept my pay, you know what I'm saying? But... Yes, if you order them online, they probably going to get canceled. Something of that nature, man. So just be careful with it, man. But I'm going to keep it a boat with you. I like these, right? Look at this material real quick. Let me get y'all that. Y'all see that material here? That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? For me, when I look at my shoes, I look at the details on the shoe, right? I look at the details. Look at, look at the detail on the toe box. Like, sometimes you got to get that good visual on that. You know what I'm saying? Look at the details on that toe box, man. The Nike Air. Just look at everything. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people are, are not really feeling this shoe. Well, let me say this, okay? So I feel like we need to adjust the verbiage when we say people are not feeling the shoe. I would say um, it doesn't seem like it's reselling for a lot, which makes you assume that people don't like the shoe. Um, I think that's the correct way to put it. You know what I'm saying? Put it in correct terms. But when I've spoken to people, they've also expressed that they really ain't rocking with the shoe. So I guess that I feel like I'm pretty much right on with what I'm saying about nobody really liking the shoe or really rocking with the shoe, which I don't fully understand, but it's all good, man. But listen, I like the shoe a thousand percent, man. I love them. I'm definitely going to add these in the collection along with them Harris ones. I like them a lot, man. I feel like this shoe will go up over time. I don't know if it's maybe because this back part or the actual heel badge that kind of throw people off, but I thought it actually gave that extra um to it, you know what I'm saying? It almost, to me... If if it's me, I would have called this shoe the White Shadow. You know what I'm saying? This would have been like the White Shadow ones. You know what I'm saying? If they was named that, they probably 
would have been more, but I like the crackling, um, like detailing on the back of the sock liner you see right there. You know what I'm saying? Even around to the toe box. Even to your upper, too. You know what I'm saying? Like, that mid going right there, right with the laces. Like, you see that material? There you go. Yeah, y'all can see it now. You know what I'm saying? I actually, I actually like I like the appearance of it. I feel like a lot of people are going to return back to this shoe. And, um, now one thing I don't understand is the color of these laces. You know what I'm saying? They gave the, the crimson, the light crimson uh, laces to go with them. Don't think I would implement those on, I said implement? Jesus. I sound very uh, corporate just now. Don't think I would put those laces in these shoes. I'll probably just keep them laced up with the black ones or maybe. I ain't gonna lie to you, the white laces might go crazy in these. White laces might go crazy in these, man. Yeah, the white laces might go crazy in these, but I like them for the most part, man. Oh, the inside of it is that crimson too, so that's probably where the lace come with. But yeah, bro. Rock them with them heavy. Like, like, them, like them a ton, bro. Like them a whole lot, man. Y'all let me know in the comment section right now. Let me know how many of y'all actually picked up y'all pairs from your DTLRs or your, um, if you need a Rue Villa or your Jim Jazz. Did any of y'all pick up pairs from any of y'all stores and then find out they got released or got pushed back? Let me know right now, man. But I'm actually rocking with these right now, man. So if I got to add a title to it, man, I would say these might be slight pressure. I ain't going to say they pressure pressure. You know what I'm saying? They slight pressure. You know what I'm saying? I think... Uh, this is going to be a late bloom. I think a lot of people going to come back to the shoe like, dang, I should have copped that shoe. Um, or now that it's July 2nd, they might have some more time to think about it. I think with it dropping on July 2nd, July 4th being two days from that, I feel like the market value might actually increase on these because I think a lot of people are going to be copying these for 4th of July. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be on a lot of y'all feet. You know what I'm saying? So I can see it happening. You know what I'm saying? They caught the grade school sizes too. This is probably going to be your 4th of July shoe right here. Yes, indeed. Y'all pulling up to Uncle Charlie uh, cookout in the backyard in the stage haze, man. So let me know what y'all think in the comment section of these right here. You know what I'm saying? Even I ain't get to show y'all the outer sole. You know what I'm saying? I'm just talking about the shoe, but we're also treating it as a review for y'all since they haven't dropped yet. Let me know what y'all think, man. How y'all feel about the stage haze? Are y'all rocking with them? Are y'all not? I think they're nice. Love the material. Love the detailing that went into the actual shoe. And that's why I'm vibing with it a lot, man. So drop in the comment sections right now. And tell me what y'all think, man. But listen, I can't hold y'all up for long. Um, I got another video I'm probably going to drop over the weekend of some pickups that I grabbed. Um, but I just want to knock this video out for y'all real quick and get this going. Y'all see it right here. Y'all see what my hat say. You feel me? Yeah, so you know who I'm rocking with. You know who I'm rocking with, man. I got Celtics in six. You know what I'm saying? So I'm super excited for this game tonight. Hopefully my boys don't let me down and, and you know, we knock it out of the park, man. But I'm telling you right now, if we win tonight... I, 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 as a Boston fan, I'm going to keep it a buck, right? I'm going to keep it a buck. As a Boston fan, I'm going to say that Golden State may win tonight. It's very important that they split on the road, right? If they win tonight, I'm not going to be mad because it's, it's very important for them that they split on the road. But I'm telling you right now, if we win tonight, Celtics in five. I'm out, man. Take flight with the flies, man. If you ain't flying, me just ain't flying, right? Hustle, motivate, long live, nip, man. And we out.